come back to uh that was such a weak start do I, I don't care <laughs> welcome back to neptunia the, the mega tag mentioned neptunia i really should have said the whole name and we're just gonna continue with the scene i don't really know what to say i, I actually have other characters we can play now which is sure? these two i'm going now because they didn't grind any can i, I grinded a, a little bit so they're they're pretty high level now and they have their their best equipment, so they should do pretty well. Especially Uni. Uni does a lot of damage. So it's, I guess it's at the moment it's a bunch of. Uh... Yeah, she does a ton of damage. So yeah, I'm gonna be uh, I'm gonna start uploading more. So I could be uploading. I'm gonna be uploading five times a week. But you'll notice this week and this maybe oh, this week and next week and maybe the third week as well. There will probably be uh, I'll be double uploading. Get out of here. <laughs> didn't even take any damage, didn't have to switch to Nepgear. So Nepgear is kind of like my Famitsu, she's going to be like my fallback character. Yeah, and see they're pretty high level. Actually, I think you need to surpass Tamsoft in level. Oh wait, no, she's equal to Tamsoft. Maybe. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. Oh. So, we've shot every scene except the final one. How'd it go out there, everybody? See anything suspicious? Unfortunately, I was unable to locate anything out of the ordinary. Yeah, I'm all out of ideas here. I looked everywhere and didn't find a thing. I see. Oh, come on. You student council members depress me. Hey, watch it! I bet you're just mad you couldn't find anything either. Actually, I found something. See? Told you. Wait, what? Is that true, Tamsa? Definitely. I saw traces of the entrance in a freshman class. Room 1-6. Room 1-6? Are you certain? At this academy, each grade only has up to five classes. That couldn't possibly be correct. Oh, but it is, Vert. There's a hidden door in the janitor's locker of 1-5 connecting the rooms. How did you even know there would be a hidden door there? I found it when the school had that hide-and-seek tournament a while ago. I used to use it to ditch class. Ah, oh, crap. I just said that in front of the Ice Queen VP, didn't I? First off, that nickname is stupid. Second, I'd normally scold you, but I'll pardon you this time. <sighs> Dodge that, bullet. However, next time you decide to play hooky, you will not get away with it. Mark my words. Damn. That sounds scary. All right, let's go. Tamsoft, show us the way. Sure thing. Follow me. So this is room 1-6. It looks just like a regular classroom. No. There's something else here. I can sense it. H how? I can't sense anything. Listen carefully. Actually... I don't think you need to listen very carefully. Uh. Hmm. Huh? Uh. Uh. Bunnies. <laughs> need more bunnies. <laughs> hey, who's doing that? You're ruining our horror movie vibes with silly internet lingo! I assume that was Hachima Jin. According to my intel, it loves to make money and troll people. Wow. Who would have thought that the last boss would be the one to kill the serious mood in the end? But at least we figured out Hachima Jin's location. How are we going to defeat it? Why don't we just force it out? You're saying you want to break the seal? Yeah. I don't think it was able to regain all of its power. I think we can take it. Ah, so your plan is to attack while it's still vulnerable. Exactly. Got it. 
then we should start preparing for our final battle. Oh, so what? Okay, so scene 12. We're just finished with scene 11. So scene 12 is going to be the, the final scene, okay. The people will love this. Oh, hello? There we go. <laughs> Alright, so scene 12. This battle's gonna be the final scene of our movie, huh? That's right. This is gonna be our youth captured for everyone to see on the silver screen. Man, I never thought shooting this movie for the club would ever become such a big deal. Same here. I just wanted to write a script. Who would have known? Yeah, I also thought we were only going to make one movie. Yet here we are. The world's fate is on our shoulders and nobody's the wiser. What a weird feeling. You mean this won't ever make it to the public records? Well, our ancestors left this history in the dark for a reason. Why expose it all now? You're right. At least we'll have the memory of it. Yep, the mistakes of the past will remain buried. But as long as we remember it, that'll be good enough. With that dark history in mind, we just have to make sure we never repeat that same mistake again. Ah, so we accept that it happened and just move on. Right. Although, I'm sure that dark history was never intended. Even if that thing was sealed as a result of the mistake, I'm sure it was born as hope in the beginning. That's why we shouldn't deny it either. We're CPUs, you know. We might be able to accept it for who it is and use it in the future. You're right, Blonzie. But... What if Hachimajin is just so bad that we can't accept it the way it is? Huh. Oh. Hmm. Screw it then. Ah! What the hell, Blonzy? Were you just talking out of your ass or something? It loves money, right? And trolling people? Dark history or not, I'm starting to think this is just a pretty bad person in general. So that whole speech was for nothing? Uh, we should get going now. What a weird moment to have before a final battle. I wonder if this is the right mood we should have. I guess the mood being so light like this is kind of our thing. You have a point. All right, enough talk. Let's break Hachima Jin's seal. Do the honors, Uzume. Wake up, you bastard! You're going down, Hachima Jin! Uh oh, wait, we had to, okay, we had to just defeat it. <clears throat> Alright, well, we'll take... I'll meet your expectations. What? Uni really? Yes. Here. I'm going now. They shall defeat Hachimajin. <laughs> Waited long for us, Hachimajin? Oh, whoops. Seems like a human is here. They've come to defeat us. <laughs> Such a waste of time. GG! <laughs> so this is the Zombie King. Not the prettiest face I've ever seen. There's a strange aura around them and it's kind of intimidating. Ah, yes. It's radiating a gross medicine aura. I feel quite unpleasant just looking at it. But if we defeat him, it'll all be over. It will all be over, she says. <laughs> You hear that? <laughs> so conceited. GG. <laughs> you can't defeat me. Why is he so annoying? Eesh, well, at least I won't feel bad when we destroy it. Let's do this. <laughs> Can you give me a few? Reminds me of, uh, the <laughs> it reminds me of what uh, Deep Sea King said in One Punch Man. Oh, this is an interesting area. So this is fail. Here's my partner. Hmm. It's interesting. You're mine. <gasps> it's your chance. No, 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 no. Oh wait, it didn't hit me at all though. <laughs> I might need to get. <laughs> might need to get. I might need to get the meat suit in the camps off. Good. 
Alright. Right there! Use your fire spirit! And... Got it! Get up. Also, I did, like, the whole game I spent, like, pretty much just doing R1 square and R1 triangle for my specials. It's fun. How did that hit me as Uni? I was completely in the middle of it. I was nowhere close to getting hit from it, and I still just got insta-killed by it. So it does have a lot of health, all right. Yeah, I was saying like like here with with Uni. Fun. I was saying that like here with Uni, and I, I should have got. Oh, okay, so it's arms and stuff have different health. Okay. Oh, I lost one of the arms. All right. Didn't do anything. Oh, ow. <laughs> that was not what I. Jeez, it could be any moment. Oh, okay, so the stuff came back. It, it, like, it tried to make it so that it was like it seemed like a normal boss fight where you could take parts of the body out, but like it doesn't show you. I, I, like the big problem is there's still health bars, so you don't get the indication that you're supposed to take the arms out when they fall down like that. finish what I said earlier, but like, uh, the whole game I spent, like, with the special abilities, I did the square one and triangle, but I'm using a piece of control, if you can't tell, but, <laughs> so pretty much, I don't know how to really describe it in a, in a way that... with the uni though. And there's no way to like as far as I know there's no way to reliably lock onto its arms like this. Alright. I'll switch. That you let your guard hit. Aha! A little lackluster. But... How much XP is this? <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm gonna get like a hundred thousand or something like that? Woohoo! What? Twenty-six thousand? There's no way that's the end. Yes. <laughs> Twenty-six thousand, really? Um, are we going to lose? Can 
not even happen? That's a lie. <laughs> There's no way the dark history can lose. <laughs> we won't disappear. <laughs> Are we going to be used by this cheap student film and disappear? I don't want this. We're the last boss and mastermind and get treated like this. <laughs> this is hilarity to the max. <laughs> Hurry, everyone. We gotta get Hachima Jin's destruction in the last scene. We're ready. Okay, for the last time, action! <sighs> did we do it? Yeah, we really did. We defeated the Zombie King. If he's been the source of all of this, do you think everyone's gone back to normal now that he's defeated? It's possible. We have to go outside and see for ourselves. Uh. Nope. Still zombies. Uh. 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 Well, if we're the only two survivors on this island, it's romantic in a way, right? Is that weird to say? Wait! We don't have time for this! The association was gonna bomb the whole island if their plan failed. I guess this is the end for me. What? The bomb's already heading here. We don't have time to joke around. I'm not joking. Look at my arm. It's already starting to rot. I've been here just a little too long. My vaccine has lost its effect. I was hoping once we destroyed that bastard, it'd be over. But life isn't so easy. Is it? You... You gotta go. No! I'm not leaving you! Why does it have to be like this? I feel the same way, but... This is just how it's gotta be. If that's true, then... Kiss me! Kiss me before the end! But... I'm already turning. I'm half rotten. Are you sure? I don't care if you're rotten. I still love you. What? I, I can't believe this. The wounds, they're starting to heal. It's a miracle. We can still get off the island. I can be with you forever. Is that what you want, though? You're signing up for a life on the run from the association. I don't care. I want to be with you then let's do this together just the two of us yeah it'll be the two of us forever and so that's how the zombie incident that plagued the academy came to an end no one else would ever realize it that also meant that the movie we were making was wrapping up. It's done! The editing's finished! We did it, everyone! So cool! I can't believe we were able to make a second installment! It's such a waste that this is restricted to the film club's eyes only. It's okay, Blonde. We did this together as a club, so we'll always have it to look back on. You're right, Neptune. For the wait, everyone! The contest results are here! What? We were getting results today? You make me sad. How did you not know? You're the damn president of the film club. Hey, I appreciate that, but it's me we're talking about here. There's no way I'd remember. You, you say that about yourself, huh? Anyway, let's get to the results! Wait. Let's all see the results together. Right, President? You're right, Director. Great. Is everyone ready? Okay, time for the announcement! Our movie was ranked... Honorable Mention by the Judges! Yay! Wow! I can't believe this! 
We've done it! I knew any film I acted in would succeed. Uh, you're not even part of the main cast. I'm the main cast. <laughs> you don't get to talk like that. This is a major scoop. I have to get this into an article stat. Uh, I'm gonna do it first. <laughs> Those two are always at it. Congratulations, Netgear. It's all thanks to you helping me out, Uni. Thank you. R really? Well, that's nice of you to say. Ram, what is honorable mention? Is it really amazing? Hmm, I'm not really sure, but it sounds a lot more impressive than winning. Oh, then maybe the school won't have to close after all. After all the commotion, the contest website posted our movie. Unfortunately, my writing got comments like, top-notch B-movie writing, or you hate it so much you love it. The movie as a whole garnered praise, though. Critics love the touch of real zombies and that it was student-made. As for the student crisis, it seemed like people enjoyed us so much that there was a huge influx of applicants. It makes me blush a little that the main reason people were applying was because of us and not the movie. Anyway, that's how this page of our youth came to an end. Come on! Let's go work on the next scene! But our youth doesn't just end here. It will continue on until we graduate. Make a tag mention, Blonde plus Neptune versus Zombies. The end. Last boss really gonna give me 26,000 XP? You kidding me? A doggo gave me more. <laughs> Is it? Uh, okay, hold on. I'm gonna say something here. Um, there should be credits here <laughs> and probably video, but there isn't. <laughs> yeah, I, there's there's nothing, and I'm just gonna skip it because I don't know why my cutscenes and everything are like. So now it's time for our customary thank you for playing segment. How did everybody like me as the protagonist for once? I was kind of nervous since this was the first title set in school. I hope you enjoyed it. I really wish it didn't have to end here and that I could play some more with you. I know Blonde's in the middle of giving her little speech, but I'm gonna spice things up and reveal everyone's dark histories. What? What are you doing? First off, Blonde's mysterious, horrible monologue that was at the end of all those scenes. Honestly, it was so awful and inconsistent. Some scenes ended without the poem, though. Thank the heavens for that. Yeah, that thing was so tacky. Don't we have poetry workshops here or something? Blonde should really sign up for one. I'm not opposed to monologues, and I think they are great devices. Blonde's just felt so forced and noticeably snobby. In the most difficult voyages, a harsh wind can become our ally, presenting us with new friends and experiences. I want to let the wind take its course, to let fate place me wherever it would like. The whole up. If he had a model, well, he, she thing, had a model, why, did, why, why was it not in the cutscenes? Why did they not show this thing when they revealed it in like the cutscene before the boss fight? At, at, at the end of scene like scene 12 and the end of scene 11, why did they not use it? This like They used it at the end! Why did they not use it during the scenes? I just hope that it's a place I want to be. That's what she wrote! <laughs> so cheesy! <laughs> Shut the hell up, you bastard! <laughs> what? Whoa, there, blonde. You don't want to embarrass yourself in front of everyone. That's. Th this is. Um. It was written so late at night, and. I mean, even though you're the main in this game, you still somehow managed to embarrass yourself a bit. There were even times you didn't have monologues. Was that just you being lazy? 
Ah, so this is a situation where Blonde couldn't keep up with maintaining her suave persona. Is that right? Well, I mean... <laughs> I much prefer your blushing face to your usual stoic look, Blonde. <laughs> Come to think of it, that whole magical Noirina thing was also pretty insane. What? Yes. For all the wild things I've seen in this series, I was actually turned off by magical Noirina. How peculiar. No! Stop! Don't mention that name ever again! I knew you were a closet cosplayer, but I think you got a little cocky with that one. Sorry, Noir. I couldn't stop you from doing it. Don't look at me like that. I'm not the pathetic loser you think I am. I just want to forget it ever happened. Oh, no worries, Noir. You and Blonde aren't the only ones with a dark past. You're right. Nepgear and Uni also have a... Well, actually, that was wonderful in a way. It's still a dark history, I suppose. Those girls embarrassing themselves like that is way worse than whatever I did. These stories, they're just a normal part of life. This is what happens at school, you know? These will be great memories. I mean, it was fun in the moment, right? Isn't that beautiful in a way? Lon, you're exactly right. Then our story ends here for now. I hope we'll see each other again someday. Yes! I completely lost my train of thought. Mega tag <laughs> mention. Oh yeah, right. Blonde plus Neptune versus zombies. The, the um the end the credits there had like that. Okay, I don't know why. This is just I'm guessing it's the imp the port or something or maybe it's my side. I don't know. But there's no cutscenes whatsoever. There's no like I don't get to see the opening. I don't even get to see the logos for the people who made the game show up. Like I mean I see the, like the last one before this scene. I see the few that come after the intro and stuff like that, but. Or, like, is it before the intro? Yeah, whatever. But, like, I see a few of them, like, three of them, and, and then this scene. And then this screen. And, th like, that that's it. Like, there's no... I don't get to see the opening, like, music video for the, the game or anything like that. Because <laughs> I don't know why. I, it's just a black screen for me. I can hear it, but I, I don't see it. But, so, I apologize about that. I, there's no, I don't really know if there's anything they could do about it, so... Yeah, but... Alright, so that was the Mega Tech Net Mention Blonde plus Neptune vs. Zombies. Alright, so, uh... Yeah, I didn't expect it to end so quickly, but... Alright, so thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh, leave a like you did. This felt really short. I might not even cut it, because that was really short. But yeah, alright. I'll see you guys in the next one.